what is going on guys in this video i'll be showing you how you can create this logo flip animation in hitfilm express you guys might have already guessed this the inspiration of this tutorial is manchester united if you follow manchester united you might have already seen this kind of animation on the instagram feed or on facebook pages uh, let me just show you an example right here it's united it was united versus crystal palace so just play this animation and uh, this is basically what we will be creating in HitFilm Express. And in this video, um, we will be creating uh, this same animation, the Liverpool versus United. It's really a massive game, so I'm really excited for that. So without further ado, let's start our tutorial. Let's create a new composite shot. And as always, from the template, I'll choose 1080p full HD 60 frames per second. And the duration is one second, and then click on OK. Let's create a new plane layer. And uh, I'm going to change the color to red and then click on OK. Let's rename this layer to red and then again click on OK. Now I'm going to use uh, the, these two logos I found from Google. So I'm just going to drag these two logos and uh, put it above this red layer. Let me just rename this. It's going to rename it to Liverpool and this one to Manchester United. And uh, let's scale this down. So I'm just going to go to Liverpool layer, the transform, and uh, let's ch change the scale and maybe make it 40%. And um, go to the Manchester United layer, transform, and then scale, set it to 50%. Okay, now click on new layer and cl then click on camera. And uh, also click on this icon that says layer dimensions. And from the list, select 3D plane. Do the same thing with your other Manchester United logo layer. Okay, now let's animate it. So I'm, uh, if you have seen their animation, let me just go back. So this match, United versus Palace, was a home fixture. And what they do is when they have a home fixture, they put their logo first. And uh, then it is followed by the logo of the visiting team. So... Since this is going to be an obey fixture, that means that we have to put the Liverpool logo first and then the Manchester United logo. So I'm just going to animate the Liverpool logo and uh, you'll see these rotation options right here. So I'm just going to select the rotation Y and we'll animate that. So I'm just going to go forward to maybe about 30 seconds forward, not 30 seconds, the 30 frames forward and um, I'm just going to change the rotation and uh, put it to negative 90 and hit enter on your keyboard now let's move backwards maybe about six frames and uh, then set the rotation to zero so oops i forgot to create the keyframe so make sure that you click on this icon that to create the keyframe and that's uh, created the keyframe at the wrong position so i want this to create keyframe to be at 30 frames and it's going to move back six frames and i would like the rotation to be at zero uh, let's scrub through and see our animation and this is what we have so far okay looks cool now double click on this last keyframe and uh, select your manchester united logo layer and just simply shift it and put it where your playhead is now expand your manchester united logo layer now Click on this circle icon on the rotation Y to create a keyframe. And uh, at that position, I would like the rotation to be at 90. And now I will move forward uh, six frames and set the rotation to zero. And uh, let me just show you what we have, what we with what we did. So this is our animation. Looks cool. And also you can enable the motion blur on both these layers by simply clicking on these motion blur icons. Okay, now uh, all we need to do is create that wipe animation. So it's pretty simple. Let's create a new plane layer. And I'm just going to change the color to black and rename this layer to black. And I'm just going to move this to the left i'm going to expand that black layer go to transform and set the rotation to 15 degrees 
also I would like to increase the scale of this layer maybe something like there now let's animate it so at the first frame make sure your playhead is at the first frame create the position keyframe and basically I want it to be away from the scene and let's move to the last frame and just simply drag it to the right right there and also maybe increase the scale okay now let's see what we have created this is our animation now select your black layer and simply uh, drag it and put it below your Manchester United logo layer and uh, let's play our animation and see how that looks okay we have some glitch right here as you can see that the black is already visible at our first frame just simply go to your black layer select the first frame and just simply drag it uh, to the left and move it away from your scene now let's play our animation and see how that looks <laughs> that is looking awesome so uh, lastly what you can do is create a new text layer uh, set the width to 1920 and then click on OK. Select your text tool and type in your text. I'm just going to type in Liverpool versus United. Hit the enter key on the keyboard to jump to the next line and then I'm going to type in Premier League. Uh, select your text and um, the font that I, I'm using is PBAS and the font size is 72. Now I need to the center this text to the center by simply clicking on this icon that says center alignment. Select your selection tool and uh, just simply put this text below your logo. Maybe then you can also decrease the size of your font. Let's see our overall animation. Yeah, that is looking really nice. And that's it for this video, guys. I hope it was helpful and um, please do hit the like button if this video helped you and uh, maybe subscribe to this channel because i'll be uploading more awesome content on this channel and also it will motivate me if you do subscribe and uh, like this video so i'll see you in the next video till then take care peace